Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to make your Mac computer run faster and smoother. So the first thing you want to do is come over here to the Apple and click Software Update. And it's going to check for new software. The other ones are these programs right here. Only X deletes caches. iFreeMem is this thing right here. And don't ask me how it does it, but it deletes the... Well, it doesn't delete, but it makes smaller um, things in your RAM so you can download more stuff. Uh, Monolingual de deletes languages that you do not want. Xnumer, you put apps in there and it compresses them. And Clean My Mac is a program that goes through everything in your computer and it can delete things. Like uninstall applications and it can go through your languages and see if they can compress them anymore. So the first one is using only X, so open up that, and you're going to click check for smart status. And now it's going to verify my startup volume. And guys, I will be right back after this is done loading. Okay guys, as you can see my volume verified the startup volume appears to be okay. So that's good. Now put in your password. That's just like a little warning box. And go right here to cleaning. And you can check whichever ones that you do not want. And you will click execute and you will click continue and now it's going to cleaning in progress so I'll be right back alright guys so it's doing this and I'll be right back with um when this is done going through what's supposed to do okay guys as you can see my cleaning was finished so that's one thing you could do Be right back. Okay, guys, the next one is called iFreeMem. Now, this deletes, not deletes, but like makes your RAM, uh, not RAM, RAM smaller. So, what you do is click Optimize Memory. And the green section is a section that's free, and it's going to try to get as small as possible. And then at the very end, it'll get really big, as you see. So that the green section is how much RAM I have free thanks to this program. It's a great program. The next program is called Monolingual. And this deletes languages that you do not want. I don't want Chinese, Danish, Dutch. All I want is English. And the checked section is the section that you're deleting. And the unchecked section is the ones that you want. So, and by the way guys, I am not responsible for if you screw up. Um, so don't screw up. <laughs> so making sure that only my English is unchecked. And it is, so I'm going to click remove. Click continue. I'm going to put in my password. And click OK. Now while this is going guys, I'm going to pause the video and I'll be back when it's done. OK guys, as you can see I removed 0 bytes but that's because I already ran this. And for input menus, the only one you want unchecked is um, Apple Keyboard Layouts. Make sure that's the only one unchecked. And remove the rest. For this one, this one is up to you. Well, no, I shouldn't say it's up to you, but it's what you have. Like, I have an Intel processor, and it says current. I have no idea how to pronounce that. Architures, architecture. I have an Intel 64-bit, so I just want those two unchecked. And I would remove them, but I don't really want to keep on pausing videos and make you guys mad. The next one is called XSlimmer, and this is a great program. What it does is take your applications and it makes them smaller. So what you would do is just right here, 
Then we click Applications, go to Add, click the Application folder, and click Open. And guys, if I haven't said this already, I'll put all of the applications and I'll put them in the description box. So, with a lot of them, you can get a lot of um, memory out. So you, I got up to like, I think six gigabytes through all my applications. So now I'm ready to swim. So I'm just gonna click swim, and it's all done. Pretty insane, I think. I love it. Next application is called Clean My Mac. And guys, I have another video of this, so watch it, please. Um, basically, you would click this lock box, put in your password, and click scan. And when this is done scanning, I'll come back. Okay, guys, now that you see that all of them, like, it's gone through everything, so, like, my trash and leftovers, I can check that. Um, system junk, universal, binaries, language files, logs, and caches. Um, guys, I will say this. If, um, this will happen for most of you in your cache, if it says, it says what out, whatever out of whatever, if you go here, um, make sure you check, they're all checked besides the red boxes. Because, if you say, if I click this, it will say, are you sure you want are you sure you would like to select a gray listed item for removal? Removing gray listed items may result in unexpected behavior of some applications. So you do not want the red boxes checked. So, once that's done, click clean. Sometimes it asks you to put in a password again if it's been a while. So they've all been checked. And everything has been deleted. Um, let me pause this first. All right, something just happened. All right, whatever, guys. I will put the links into the description. Um, guys, please comment, rate, and subscribe. And thanks for watching.